Good morning. Go to the golf course. Do I need a windshield pass or anything? Cool. Thank you. <laughs> what up? All right, we're in. We'll see how long this lasts. There's a couple of good little ponds in here, so we'll see what we can do. What's going on? Welcome to our channel, Naughty Life. My name is Alex, and my wife Jill and I do fishing and boating videos. Everything you do on the water here in Southwest Florida. And today we are doing another freshwater pond fishing video. We're gonna to try to get into some golf courses. We're gonna hit some local residential ponds, some that you've seen before, some new ones. We've got some pretty cool conditions. It's gonna be a nice, beautiful day coming off of a cold front. So we hope you enjoy. Please remember to like, comment, subscribe. And with that being said, let's get right into this video. All right, y'all, we're at the first spot. Can we throw in the uh, whopper plopper for a little bit? and then switch over to a worm, but this looks pretty good right now. See what we can get done first thing here in the morning. This thing is a unit. Beautiful morning out. New moon, some major feeding cycles later on in the day today. So it should be pretty good. We're gonna go after some big old bass. This is the big bluegill whopper plopper. Get a better idea how big this sucker is. This is the big one. Oh, cool, a little chopper action. So as you guys know, if you're a subscriber of the channel, we don't typically do freshwater fishing. So I've taken the last couple days to do a YouTube deep dive myself and really learn as much as I can about freshwater fishing, pond fishing, you know, being a saltwater angler. Obviously I know what question to ask and some of the trends that we're looking for, but it's, you know, totally different than going out and fishing for snook and redfish. So I wanted to give a shout out to three channels that really helped me learn more about the pond fishing freshwater fishing i have no affiliation with these guys um, but every question that i had they were popping up so tyler's real fishing was the first one he was super helpful when talking about pond stuff uh, we also had a lot of stuff popping up from kicking their bass tv he does a lot of like golf course stuff which we're going to try to get into today um, so shout out to, uh, to him, as well as Bass Fishing HQ. Again, a lot of the questions that we were, you know, looking up about different baits to use, those three channels were the ones that came up the most often. So if you guys are looking to learn more about freshwater fishing, pond fishing, and just get out there and, and fish in uh, some of these ponds by your house, I'll link all of their channels down in the description box below. All right. This looks like a really good spot. I drive past here all the time. I'm gonna start with the uh, top water. Hopefully get something done. Apologize for any road noise. Little turtle head po poking up right there. There's a lot of little minnows in here. Got some lily pads and everything in here. This is a pretty good spot. There we go. First one of the day, a little baby one. Yeah. Oh no, dude, don't get stuck in there. There we go. Hey, not too shabby. First one, a little largemouth, nothing crazy. Similar size to the other ones we were catching the other day. He crushed it though. First fish on the whopper plopper. Hey, thanks bud. Appreciate the catch. In he goes, all right, go for a bigger one. Oh yeah, that's a money shot right there. Hope you guys can see it. It might be a little bit dark from right up where those bushes are. The little pond is tough. Reeds are all kind of overgrown. So I've been working my way around. There's not really a good opening. Uh, here's a decent one. It's like the first decent opening I've seen. I don't want to hook a good fish and then lose it because of the freaking weed. So we've got some current moving here with this pump, which is interesting. I guess they've got some type of filtration system on here. Nice little picnic tables. This looks like a decent spot. There's a water uh, feed-in tube. This might be okay here. Let's try a couple casts. 
Is that a fish? Yeah, fish, all right. Oh, it's a dink. Come on, really? Good little fighter. Dude, that is the tiniest, tiniest bass known to man. Real pretty though. Look at that fish in the light. Hammered it. All right. Not necessarily the size we're after, but can't complain about a little a little bite crushed that thing freaking spun it good to know there's probably another one stacked in over there so let's do it again good morning go to the golf course do i need a windshield pass or anything cool thank you you too <laughs> what up all right we're in We'll see how long this lasts. There's a couple of good little ponds in here, so we'll see what we can do. It'd be short-lived, but give it a try. Come on, let's make this sneaking in worth it. There's not a whole lot of weeds, which is good. I think something just struck at it. Oh, there we go. There's a fish. Worth it, let's go. Oh, he's staying down. Oh, what? Get out of town. Yo, I just doubled up. Never in my life. Look at this! What in the world? Are you seeing this? Look at that. Two fish, one bait. What in the world? Are you kidding me? What? Are you kidding me? What? Oh man, he chomped this thing. Oh, of course, I don't have my pliers on me. Dude. I've never seen it happen, ever. That is the coolest thing ever. I know, dude, I'm sorry, I'm trying to get it. All right, I gotta get my pliers. That was crazy. Literally just doubled up on the same bait. I've never had that happen before. Two little dinks, but hey, they fought like a two pounder. There's a good one, there's another one. Oh my God, they're stacked in here. Oh my God, dinks. Good, get out of here. Hilarious. Oh my God, this is awesome. There's gotta be a Mondo in here. There's little turtles, I'm seeing bait. Got some birds. Where's the big mama? Where's the big mama at? All right, get out of here. Ducks, I have got 30%. I didn't bring my backpack, which is probably a mistake. What are these weirdos doing? Oh, they're not happy. They're fighting. Real cockfight over there. Oh, they're not happy. Quit it, you're scaring all the fish. I will end a bird's life if he comes over here and tries to attack me. For real. We having duck soup. There's a fish. There's a fish. There's a fish. Yes. Decent. Decent, decent. He's been caught before. It's like, there we go. Real low on this GoPro battery. You know what? I'm here, there's fish here. I'm gonna switch this GoPro battery out and I'm gonna go hit that side of the lake. Oh, man, he hammered it. Y'all see that? I'm gonna have to go back. Dang it. Was not paying attention. Was not expecting that. Spot looks really good. Oh, yep. Oh, yeah. These birds are all over the place. They just dive? What? Not good, come on, really? Yes, yes, Whew. I just saved myself about 10 bucks there. And you do it again, you stupid f Come on, dude, figure it out.
Ah, spider. Ah. Sorry, y'all. I hate spiders. Oh, something's on it. Something's on it. Come on. There it is. Oh, yeah. I don't know what this is. It's big, though. Is it a gar? Whoa. No way. No freaking way. Y'all, I've never caught one of these before. It's a gar. That's what's spinning. No, what? Look at that. Dude, that is sick. What in the world? All right, chill out, brother. Chill out, chill out. Chill out. Whoa, look at that. Yo, that is awesome. I've never caught a gar. Shit. Okay, all right. Relax. He's got some nasty chompers. Did I really not bring my backpack out here? What an idiot. I gotta get my freaking backpack. Gross. Holy smokes. Swimming away. Man, that thing was freaking cool. Wow. They are disgusting, but that was so cool. I'm gonna try to get another one. Freaking crushed it. That's what all these things are. That are popping, it's, they're all these gars. I saw him turn and he waked on it, and then he hit it. Look, there's another one on him. And he hit it on the stop, that was so cool. I've never caught one of those, so cool. He's a good fighter too. Guys, can you guys see all these things popping? That's hilarious. That was crazy. Not good, not good, not good. Not good, not good, come on. Whew. All right, you. Oh my goodness. These things are fired up right now. There it is, got another one. Let's go. Oh yeah, it's a better one. Holy smokers. Oh, got him. Oh, he's in the weeds. Get out of the weeds. Get out of the weeds. Yeah. Oh, he's a different one. Wow. Look how dark he is. No, no. What? What in the world? He found the water. Yo, he popped off and then literally went straight back into the water. Insane. There we go. Yes, sir. Oh, all right. Nice. Good little bass. Come on, get out of the weeds. 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 Come on, dude. Jesus. Oh, he spit it right there. Dick. Oh, they love this thing. Oh, right there. <laughs> Got him. Little bass. Bass. Yeah, we got a bass, another bass. It's about freaking time. There we go. Oh yeah. Oh, a little baby guy. Oh, dude, where'd, you, where'd my worm go? Oh man. Freaking worm is gone. Number, number three. All right, so the blue's working. Let's try the red. All right, we threw the uh, little red bug out. Speed worm still. It's been working pretty good. Three for three on the last three casts. Got him? Yeah, got him. Oh yeah, get out of the weeds. Get out of there. Whoa, a little better one. Good solid one and a half pounder. They're getting bigger, y'all. Look at that guy. Decent. Yeah. Not bad. Oh, there's a couple right there. Zooming. Sweet. Driving all over the place trying to find locations and I should have just stayed at the usual spots because they're producing as usual. All right, well, we've got a uh, multi-species day going. Pretty cool. All right, y'all, two more spots, and then we're gonna call it a day. Some stuff moving around over here again. Oh, there we go. Oh, we went straight into it. Oh boy, decent fish. Yes, no, yeah. He came out and crushed it. 
Yay! Another bass. Of course, I didn't bring my freaking pliers down here again. That's right. Oh, got him in the bottom of his jaw. Sorry, dude. God, he crushed that thing. Good little bass. They're getting fatter. I'm gonna go walk them down. There he goes, sweet. She looks like a good, good little spot here. Come down here. Right on. Man, he freaking pummeled that thing. Love top water hits. Gotta love it. All right, so a little bit closer to this edge than I'd like to be, but I'm pretty quick. I can get out of here pretty clear. I can see, so that was awesome. Came right out of this little tube. And the sun's coming out. That's gonna kill the top water bite. Good, how are you? Good. Catch anything? I uh, just got like a little one pound bass, nothing crazy. <laughs> I know they're in here. Yeah, I was, have you been fishing many of the ponds? Cause we had a fish kill in one of them. I was oh. wondering if you saw many dead fish. Uh, so I really, I'm more of a saltwater, So I just kind of started the last couple weeks. Yeah. Um, but I've been fishing, I fished this one, the one that's right over there, this one right there, the one that's down on. I haven't really seen any, no. Yeah. It's okay. It, it's in a, it's back. It's, okay, I got gotcha. you. Okay. It was bad. So. Wow. Yeah. Is it just was it from the hurricane? You think like think so. stuff? Uh, so much, so much runoff, so quick. Yeah. One of them got oxygen depleted. Shoo. One of our smaller ponds that doesn't circulate great. So gotcha. Maybe. Okay. I might yeah, I was just over by. Um, so I went down towards the. And there's that like gated community that's right on the left side before you start to get into that. Yeah, there's a pond right there. I think it's part of it, but you can get in right off that road. Yeah. I caught two little gars in there just earlier today. So yeah, it's actually a preserved pond. Okay. And it's on the back side of the property. So when you access this little inflow area, because I, I go there to check the water flows. Yeah. And there's been some big bass pushing in there. Okay. So it's all the way back, like if I'm at the, all the way back that way? Yeah, instead of taking the, take the first entrance into the plaza okay. and go straight back to the back corner and just park Is it that area. same one that, that I was probably fishing that you passed? Same okay. Area. And it's just a little bit further back there. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Right on. All right. Appreciate it, man. Good luck. Thank you. All right, y'all, so this is probably the last pond for today. I'm probably gonna include another day, go hit some more quick tomorrow. I was talking to that guy and he gave me some intel on a spot that's pretty close that feeds off of some uh, wetlands. So he says it holds Mondo bass back in there. So I'm gonna give that a shot. Pretty sure it's the same spot that we were at where we caught those gar. It's just a different part further in. So we'll check that out probably tomorrow. He did say that unfortunately with the hurricane, one of the ponds, actually several of the ponds, with all the runoff, had some issues with uh, the oxygen levels getting depleted. So that's obviously not good. There was a fish kill in one of them. So hopefully it's not happening to these other ones that we've been trying that used to be good because that would suck. We're gonna do a couple more casts with the whopper plopper, see if we can get any interest. And then I'm gonna throw the worm for a few casts around these weed lines. And then we'll probably call it a day. All right, y'all, so we wanted to wrap up today's video here in the office. We've got a couple of exciting announcements, so don't click away just yet. Uh, first and foremost, if you're a returning subscriber, you'll notice we've got a couple of updates here in the office. Uh, we're really excited. We've got some podcast and interview style videos coming in the pipeline, so you're not gonna wanna miss it. Speaking of not missing out, as of recording this, we've got about 400 subscribers, which is absolutely incredible. We appreciate every single one of you. One thing we wanted to note is that in the last 28 days, we've had about 8,800 returning viewers and 87% of our watch time is done by people who aren't subscribed. So basically what that means is people are coming to the channel, they're enjoying the content, and they're coming back, they're just not subscribed. So it would really mean the world to us if you'd hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. Without doing that, YouTube doesn't know who else to recommend our videos to. So again, it's totally free for you to do. 
it would mean the world to us if we had just 10% of the 8,800 that are coming back and watching subscribe, we would basically triple the size of our channel overnight. So with that being said, if you'd hit that subscribe button again, it would mean the world to us. And make sure you watch this video right here. Uh, we had an absolutely epic day fishing for redfish. Jill actually got her PB redfish, which was the biggest redfish I've ever seen in person. We had a friendly little manatee that was hanging around the boat for about an hour, so you're not gonna wanna miss out. So make sure you click that video right here on the right. With that being said, life short, live naughty. We'll catch you in the next one.